Hello, good people of the internet. I realise I'm saying hello as I go to sleep, but never mind. Today I'm doing a thing which I've been working on for a good two or three days now. Uh, as you can see, I have a lot of andesite, even more diorite, and thankfully slightly less granite. Um, I've been digging a little bit of a hole. Uh, not, not down there, as you might expect. No, I have been digging a hole ready for a slime farm. And this is all the stone I got from it. All of these shulker boxes are filled with stone. Not even kidding, it's ridiculous. Also, I got a lot of coal, some iron, and some other stuff. Um, it's a big hole, guys. I am making a slime farm uh, designed by Il Mango, I believe it is. And as you can see, I've been busy. I've been doing a lot of work. Uh, so basically, I've dug this hole, which took forever. And then I placed these half slabs, uh, which didn't take half as long, but was still tedious. Um, it's not finished yet, because I still need to make it look pretty by putting a stone brick down the sides, etc. And I haven't actually lit up that cave, which is clever of me. Also, like, I'd really need to... Well, I don't need to. I need to patch up the sides because, you know, lava lakes and things, I don't know, it's not the greatest. Um, but my mission now, now that I've done all the boring, tedious stuff, is to place the track, which it's going to use to, uh, which I'm going to use to collect the slime balls. Um, so the slimes are eventually going to be attracted to the edge uh, by iron golems, and then killed by magma blocks, which is, yes, they are called magma blocks. Good, I got it right, woohoo. Um, so the magma blocks are going to go at the sides here, and the golems are going to be in a big tower, um, both at this side and that side, I think. Uh, I might be able to get away with one, we will see. In which case I probably... No, I did need the hole this size. So apparently it's, uh, slime farms are more efficient if you dig uh, up to sky, um, so that it's all kind of... Uh, just there uh, and it's also more efficient if you have it only in the two bottom sub chunks instead of the third for some reason I don't get that but never mind so I'm gonna get on with placing these um, rails and then I shall I shall place magma blocks and then place golems and then we'll have a, an operational slime farm and it'll be exciting so I'm making the slime farm because I need slime for the witch farm, which is ultimately what I want to make. Um, so, also, quick story. I know you love stories, they're really fun. Uh, where's it gonna go? For, da, da, da. Uh, we actually want to start at this end, not that it makes much difference. Um, one, two, three, three, and then I'll do three normal, I think. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Il Mango just used all powered rails, but I don't want to do that. Maybe I'll do six. One, two, three. Damn it, slimes! One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Okay, maybe we'll do three. Oh my days! Get away from me! Anyway, I was going to say, fun story, my boom mic arm, the new one, came, and I'm very excited. Uh, it is extremely nice. The microphone has to be in a different position now because the new one is longer than the old one used to be. <sighs> Shock horror. Um, but that's fine. It's now sitting above my monitor, uh, kind of hanging down in front of me. But it can't be quite as close, otherwise it would obscure my vision. So, I don't know, it's, it's, I mean, I really, really like it. It looks cooler, but I don't know whether the sound is as good. Um, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, I just realised I didn't want to do that. We wanted to do this first, there we go. Um, 
but no. Uh, so it came, and I, I picked up the box from reception, and I was like, is this the right box? Because it is so heavy. I'm not even kidding. It's insanely heavy for what it is. Um, but no, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. I don't know whether it was worth £75. I'm pretty sure you're paying, like, I don't know, at least half of that just for the name Road. But I'm not going to complain. Um, what I what I will say is that I accidentally, uh, last last episode, the video where I mentioned getting a road boom arm thing, uh, was that I totally got the name wrong. I was like, road with a H, but it doesn't have a H. It's R-O-D-E instead of R-O-A-D, and it, there's no H in that. So I was just being a bit of a pleb, to be honest. But never mind. Um, we'll just gloss over that. Basically, basically, I like it. So I'm going to do this track uh, exactly the same on the other side. And then we'll get to it. Okay, this is getting very tiresome now. I have... Okay, I didn't, I didn't press space to open my elytra soon enough there. That was that. Oh, and I don't have depth strider to get back quickly. Oh, what have I done? I hate this game. Okay, it's fine. We can deal with it. At least it, none of it fell, fell in lava or anything. I can't speak today either. Let's go. Let's hopefully not get completely destroyed by these slimes. Oh dear, I had 33 levels as well. Not that it really matters. Dear me. Okay. Okay, right, let's, um, let's put our gear back on. Okay, I have no, um, I have no food. So, oh, don't drop them. Okay, I need to put redstone torches there. So that's all fine and dandy. Boom, boom, and then repeaters, like so. And then... I see you. Get away. Right. And then minecarts like that. And then they should go and pick up everything when they are dropped. Go. Leave us. Leave us. Nobody likes you. Excellent. Right. It appears to be working. And I need to block that off because it keeps spawning stuff and it's really annoying. Oh, right. Let's uh, let's start placing magma blocks. That is the next port of call, I believe. So we're going to place them like this all the way along. Ta-da! And then when the slimes fall on them, they will die. And it will be very exciting. Okay, I didn't even need a stack per side. That is good. That is good. We get to save some magma blocks. Okie dokie. So, one of my next missions, now that I've got the rail carts and the magma blocks down, my next mission is to place the glass so that when the uh, slimes spawn, they don't jump off the sides and you know, break everything. Uh, so, I will need to head to the uh, desert, which is by the jungle. And then I have to cook it up, obviously, and place it all. It's going to be a lot of glass. Um, as you can see, slimes are a bit of a pain in the ass because they block the minecart. So I've, I've got to stop them being able to get down and, uh, and get in the way. And then once I've placed the glass, I will need to place all the iron golems and the and the extra half slabs around the top. And then it'll be done. Um, it's really actually a very simple farm, um, considering it's automatic and highly efficient. So I'm gonna pop through into the nether. Hopefully I can remember where the desert is, because um, if I don't, then I'm gonna be in trouble. Ouch. I believe, I believe it's this way. Hey, it was the right portal. Nice. Okay, I really need to set up uh, a sign system in the nether so that 
I know exactly which direction everything is in. Because, um, yeah, it's pretty easy to get lost, in actual fact. So, I don't know where to start, really. The easiest place... Oh, look, a dungeon. The easiest place to do this is just on flat ground. Uh, and then dig down. Uh, it's it's pretty, pretty good. I think we'll, we'll loot this while we are here. Take them. And that. And there's not much else, so we shall leave. Let's just... Uh, get out like that. Okay. So, my plan is, I think I'm just going to dig down like this, um, because it'll be easy. And I'll just walk along. Like so. And we'll dig a big, big ass hole. And once we've done this, uh, we will run back, cook it up, and we will place the glass. Okie dokie, it's night time. I have created a little bit of a hole. Uh, I've got a shulker box plus that of glass, which I'm hoping is enough. I mean, I don't know. It's gonna, it's gonna be close, I think. It's gonna be close, if it is enough. Um, but I'm gonna run back now and cook it up. Okie dokie then. Right, I've got all the glass. Now I just need to dye it. Because normal glass looks absolutely terrible. So, I don't think... Oh, it does. It does come up with a recipe for it. That's nice. Wait. I'm going to need so much more dye. Oh, dear. Okay. That's fine. I can get more dye. But first, I'm going to kill some of these cows. Because they're so annoying and loud. And hooray for looting and sweeping edge. Look at this. This is how you do it. Already so much better. I think once you can hear them mooing when you slaughter them, you can tell that you've got rid of almost enough. There we go. Oh gosh, um, very, very full infantry. Let's get rid of some of this. Looting is so, so good. Especially when you're killing cows. Look at that. Food for days. I think I might get rid of a few more because I have a lot of meat. So I'll have enough time to rebreed them all if I kill them. There we go. Much more manageable. I mean, this is what I got the cows for. Is to slaughter. In fact, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill a few more again. Because I really don't need this many. Look at that. Oh. I am free from the noise. Hooray. Okay. Yeah, I, I already have like three more stacks in this uh, chocker box. So, yeah, not worried at all. I might just harvest this week. Eee. I need to make an actual farm, which, you know, harvests automatically and yields a little bit more because this does not yield much at the moment but um well it yields a stack exactly because it's an 8x8 believe it or not um but yeah I, I want something that will yield like four stacks if not more than that uh but anyway in fact let's breed these guys now here you go i just slaughtered all of you so I kind of owe you this, I guess. There you go. Be happy. I got like three, four, four baby ones from that. <laughs> so worth it. And that goes in there along with that. Okay, I'm going to kill some squids and then we shall get to this thing. Where? Why are there no squids? There's usually loads of squids around. What is this? What is this, I ask you? Literally, no squids. What? I'm gonna go for a little run. There are zero squids. I'm actually so confused. Maybe the cows are taking up the massive passive mob cap. I don't know, I didn't even think that was a thing though. Oh look, there's some here. Hooray! 
Okay, I've got me some ink stacks. I have got about a stack and three quarters. Now I need to just turn it all into dye, which is going to be interesting. Uh, okay, let's make some stained glass while we're here. Good. I made light grey. I thought I made grey there for a second. I was just about to be very, very sad indeed. Okay, let me go and grab some bones from the skeleton spawner. Alrighty then. I have my glass. Much glass that is full of glass. Now I've got a couple more stacks. And now I just need to place it all. So, wish me luck, guys. Right, I didn't want to go there quite yet. Hey, it's a slime. Let's, let's get him onto the magma blocks. Come here, buddy. You jump along them. That's it. Ow. Ow. They do damage. It's actually impressive. Okie dokie. Glass time. Jump up here. I think we want it... There. That's it. So, do, oh, actually, uh, oh no, can't have that. Torches, get out. So, yeah, I'm going to place glass down the whole side of this, including over the magma blocks. And then I shall just build it up until we reach the top of the farm. Okay, so I've placed both sides, um, but I have slightly realised that... I also just basically need to do the whole of each of the other two sides. So I am going to need more glass, sadly. Um, I might have enough for one more side, but uh, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need more. Which is a real shame, but never mind. I also realised that I have screwed up slightly here because this layer here needs to be half slabs. Alrighty, I've done one of the side walls, not including the fences which the iron golems are going to sit on. Um, well, inside, actually. Uh, apparently, there needs to be a roof here. Again, no idea why, so I'm just kind of doing this. Placing a roof over this bit. Uh, also, this half slab kind of rim is going to continue out into the corners of the farm. Um, so it's going to be like a big platform. I don't know why, again, it's just part of the design. Go watch Il, Il, Il Mango's uh, video, which is in the description, and then you might understand better than me, because I do not. Ouch. Okay, I'm out of glass. I literally just have, like, this much to do, and then I, I'm done. But never mind. I can go and get more. I'll then also need lots and lots of fences. Mm. But for now, I think I might place the half slabs along the top rim. Because that is something that still needs doing. Believe it or not. So let me grab all that I have. Grab that stone as well. Turn it into half slabs. Why not? There we go. And now we can go start placing. This reminds me of building the Enderman farm. Just lots of kind of standing on a platform, placing blocks three in a row. It's just so wonderfully fun. And the thunder really makes it atmospheric. I mean, what else could you ask for, really? A nice, nice rainy day, you know, getting soaked through to the skin. It's probably cold rain as well. I mean, if temperature was in Minecraft, it would be horrific, so it's a good job it's not. But if it was, it would be cold rain. Because, well, I don't know, I, I feel like it might be cold sometimes and might be warm sometimes because we are in a swamp and swamps are I don't know quite generally generally a bit humid and sticky and warm and nasty so that's that's my guess anyway it seems to rain a lot in this world hmm anyone would think it was uh mind crack okay so I've placed the platform I need to go and get more glass for a start uh finish off this side so I need to do that bit under there and then the two top bits here I also need to, yeah, I mean, that's about it. Just do the glass and then get the iron golems in here in their fences, which, which is going to be fun. 
because iron golems have to spawn in, I believe it's at least a 1x3 space, uh, clear space. I might be even 2x3, but that means I won't be able to just spawn them inside the... Mm, inside the fences, because the fence is only a 2x1, so not big enough for them, which is a shame, and I have absolutely... Oh, no, I have more glass. Yes. Look at that. Forward planning. Having more in the in the furnaces for the win. Okay. I hope that is going to be enough. Okay, let's go place this glass. Whee! I should probably... In fact, I'm going to destroy these now, because every time I run over here... I get stuck on these lily pads, or, you know, spend more time avoiding them than it would otherwise take if I wasn't trying to avoid them, if that makes sense. And they're just pain in the ass, so... I have so many lily pads now. I mean, look at this. How many stacks is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Almost eight stacks of lily pads. Have you ever seen so many lily pads? I mean, probably, but, you know, that's not the point. I am going to go and get some pumpkins. Uh, well, in actual fact, I'm going to go and grow some pumpkins, because I don't have any. Yes. Very clever, I know. Uh, I think this is going to take... Wait, there's going to be 10 iron golems. 10 times 4 is 40 iron blocks! Oh my goodness! None of these guys are better die. That is incredibly expensive. Do I have pump? No, I don't. Uh, where are our pumpkin seeds? There we go. Let's uh, let's repurpose our farm briefly. Let's do. Oh, let's just do the whole thing. Who cares? Let's not like we're in a, a wheat shortage. In fact, we are, but we don't need wheat for anything other than breeding cows, and we have plenty of cow meat, as you can see. So, let's just grow pumpkins here. Whee! Do you, do you think we could fly down the edge? Oh, we can. Look at that. I'm a... Ouch! I was going to say I'm a flying wizard, but not true, sadly. Let's see about spawning our first iron golem. I think we'll need... We'll put stone there. Oh, dear. That's not how you make them. If we do this... And then, and then we can push him, and hopefully get him in the right place. Ah! Did he push me? No, 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 please don't, please don't, no, 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 don't walk off the edge. No, 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 otherwise I'll never get you back up. Okay, stop walking. Stop walking, dude. Please stop walking. No. Fence, there we go. One down, nine to go. Excellent. And then we, we wall them in like this. Hooray! <gasps> no! Oh, you son of a gun! Damn you! Glass goes there. Fences go here. Pies come out. Anyone get... Well, obviously, that's not the quote. Fences go here. I don't know why that reminded me of pies go in... No, sorry. Chickens go in, pies come out. But it's an amazing quote, so... You know... What can I say? Chickens go in, pies come, sorry. Chickens go in, pies come out. Ooh, what kind of pies? Apple. Ooh, my favorite. Chicken, witless. Yeah, it's a great film, great film. I almost said film wrong then. I was gonna say movie and I was like, no, 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 it's a film. <laughs> I hate it when people call them movies. I'm not American, neither are you, you fool. Not that I have anything against the Americans, but if you're British, you just do not call it a movie. Because it's just not right. So, you know, just respect the system. Respect the system. That's all I ask. Tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, we are not going to have enough fences, believe it or not, for this side, which is rather peeving. Um... But, you know, what can you do? I built fences and it wasn't enough, so I'm going to have to make more. Sad times indeed. Let's feed our cows! Hooray! Woo! This is fun, isn't it? Woo! Yay! 
But I mean, I bet the cows are happy, so... You know, my cows are happy, I'm happy because I'm a, I'm a good cow farmer like that. Yeah. Yes, so we ran out of fences, basically, and that means I needed to make more, but I don't have any more wood to make fences out of, so I'm going to have to grow a jungle tree, which is very, very sad, but, um, you know, gotta do what has to be done. Uh, I just don't know where to do it, because there's no flat ground around here, and I'd really like to do it on flat ground, you know, just casually. Ouch, okay. I, that didn't even hurt me, I just said ouch anyway, I don't know why. Oh, hey dude. Oh, thanks for helping me out. That's excellent, because <laughs> I actually need to destroy this land, so, you know, not going to complain. Yeah, but yeah, I'll just continue farming jungle trees really for a little bit because I need wood. And woods, oh no, they're gonna be a different color. Oh, I hope I ha oh no. Okay, I'm going to grow this tree and I'm just going to bugger off because I I don't even need this type of tree. I need I actually need oak trees. You get apples from um junk, uh swamp trees. More apples than you do from normal oak trees anyway. So I like cutting down swamp trees. And we kind of need to clear the land here anyway because it's in between our witch huts, so I hate it when I do that. I don't want leaves. They're very unuseful. At least for the time being. Till I decide I need them for something and I'm like, I've got no trees! And then I have to grow a load of trees <laughs> to get leaves. Oh my days, twice. What is this? Okay then, good people of the internet. I believe it is finished. I, I think it's finished. Um, I mean, I'm not an expert in these things. But, you know, I've placed all of the blocks that appear to be uh, required. And I've got all the iron golems in, which took me a little while, but you know. And I've only got 12 fences left. So I didn't overmake fences, which is nice. Because I really don't like wasting stuff. Uh, so yes, the next mission is to use all the slime balls that I've... Well, I'm going to gather, as well as these ones here. And the ones that I have gathered to create a witch farm. I've probably already got enough, actually. Uh, but, you know, I just thought I'd make the slime farm for the fun of it. And then I also need to destroy this hill, light up the area around us so that stuff can't spawn, and then hopefully we'll start getting some results, which would be really nice. But this episode has gone on way too long already. So I think we are going to call it. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you next time. Bye!